Hello everybody, uh, it's been five, uh, sorry, it's been about two and a half months since my fifth prolotherapy treatment and I just want to report in saying that things are remarkably well. Um, I feel, I don't even really think about my shoulder issue that much anymore, um, which is kind of unprecedented. Uh, there are days that go by when I don't even try to roll out my shoulder. Um, again, unprecedented. Uh, so I'm really, really happy. I think him addressing this area is actually really the the last bit of the puzzle. Um, uh, I was doing push-ups in, um, in this group exercise thing. I was doing push-ups and they wanted to have us do push-ups with our hands higher up. So, um, I noticed my shoulder was starting to give out. Now, usually the way that my shoulder feels like my shoulder gives out feels like all of this is just tired and, and just done. Um, but now I'm noticing that it felt right along the collarbone area. That's where um, I really uh, felt the pain and the discomfort, the, the place that like wanted to give out. So uh, I'm really hoping that uh, this next treatment is my last treatment, at least concerning uh, my upper body and my shoulder. Uh, I might still have work on my hips, um, but uh, it still feels a little weird to try and do pull-ups with a wide grip, neutral grip, you know, I'm, I'm fine, but with a wide grip, this area definitely feels different than this area in not a good way. Um, I still have a little bit of problems like pulling my scapula down on uh, this side. This side feels a little, still feels a little off. So I don't know if that's because the muscles, you know, are pulling up because this stuff is wrong. I don't know. I'm going to point it out to Dr. Fullerton and have him check it out. Uh, we will see. Um, but honestly, there really isn't that much to report. Uh, I'm feeling much more normal. Um, I'm not rolling out as near as I used to, and uh, uh, something I, I realized now is that when I when I would squat, uh, I'd have to really focus on trying to stabilize my core and stuff like that. And that wasn't, it was because I had a weak core, but it wasn't because the muscles were weak, it was because the muscles were damaged. Now that when he addressed the serratus, the stuff right around here, that really made my ability to hold weight like a lot more stable. It used to be like this way. So things are a lot better, things are a lot more stable. Um, I didn't realize how much this little damage and stuff like that was really the problem for lifting heavier weights. But uh, it makes sense. Um, if I have a weak core, damaged core, and I can't really push my legs that hard, at least with squatting. I do leg press, but everybody says leg press is horrible. Um, but now I'm really starting to do more weights and I'm not having to focus on my core as much. I'm able to push my legs. So that's really uh, been a great benefit. Um, hopefully push-ups and pull-ups and bench press will feel even more natural once this stuff gets finished off. But I'm feeling really good. Um, uh, yeah, just turned 35. Uh, I guess celebrating with my uh, manly beard. Um, also, uh, might as well have a guest for uh, today. Um, I thought about bringing her in earlier when she was a newer addition to the family. But, if you hold on one second. Oh, I know. I know. Oh, this, this is Penny. Penny is almost a year old, aren't you? You're almost a year old. Oh, oh. And she really, really wants uh, her bully stick. Don't you? Don't you want to say hi to that? No? So anyway. 
that's my uh, golden retriever, and uh, I like to show her off. So there you have it. Um, should be. It's uh, what day is it today? It's the fifth of March. Um, we should be seeing Dr. Fullerton at the end of the month. So there you go. Hopefully that's the end. Uh, I plan to celebrate by joining um, an Olympic lifting gym and, and trying to get back into Olympic lifting, um, provided that everything feels normal. That includes my hips, especially my hips. But I'm hoping to get all that knocked out this upcoming session. If it doesn't, I've actually scheduled an appointment the next week with Dr. Fullerton, so um, he might address you know my hips exclusively in in one section and then my upper body in the other section and that way you know being only a week apart I don't have to it won't really affect my recovery that much um cuz I'm done I'm I'm tired of uh dealing with this it's been over a year and even though I'm getting better and better I want to accelerate the process <sighs> thankfully I have the means that the cash flow isn't going to be an issue and so why not just get this over with um, as much as I love you guys, all two of you that watch this, uh, uh, I want to I wanna be done with this. So, in conclusion, this is Adam, signing off.